Greetings, YouTube. Kunis here, and let's continue our casual Burgundy Conquest campaign. Where we last left off, things were not looking that casual anymore, and admittedly, I haven't recorded this in a really long time at this point. But I do, I do still very much intend to finish this run. So we're going to have a look at how we can achieve that. Essentially, what we want for the Burgundy Conquest, we need Austria as a vassal. That is literally the only thing we need left is to attack Austria. We had worries about the Ottomans joining a coalition. That will always be a worry for us until we defeat them. How strong are they compared to us? That's always a question. They are... They essentially have about 40,000 more troops than we do, not counting our vassals. And I do suspect I have armies all over the world, whereas... Wait, do I have armies all over the world, though? I have armies... Um... Let's see if we do have armies over the world. We have one down here, which I can bring back. Um, we do have uh, armies in Africa to deal with that stuff. Um, and we do have here. We have here to have two armies in Africa, so we have about two hundred and fifty thousand troops we can use right now against the Ottomans if we were to fight them. On top of our vassals, which are not the most relevant but they're not irrelevant either in terms of tech we're the same as them we're not further ahead than them which is actually surprising uh, I did buff my absolutism to 96 which is where I want it to be I'd like for it to be even higher but I think I'm missing um, oh no I do already have political absolutism so it's already capped as it's going to get unless I can get another Five or ten somewhere. I will be getting uh, a golden age at some point, uh, but I like to keep that for the very end to truly maximize the bonuses. I was also trying to kill the coalition before I went ahead. I still have Nassau to deal with, who's allied to Nuremberg. Wait, I could kill that right now. That's that's kind of harmless. I guess I could just kill that right now. You guys are only allied to each other. The problem is if I attack them, I attack Portugal again. That was, that was the, the limiting factor. Portugal is currently at war with Mutapa and Lunda. Why? Oh, he's uh, oh he's fighting that. Okay. Did he lose the fort? There's a fort over here, I think. Oh, and Kisti has some... Uh, <laughs> some particular fun down here. The Ottomans are doing the buying provinces shtick. Because, of course, they are. Aragon is now a... Uh, what is this? Aragonese separatists. I need to deal with that. Where are my boats? My boats are up here. Okay, I'll take this stack. I'll come deal with the Aragonese Separatists and the Corsican Separatists. Hey, what? Get on the damn boats. Get on the damn boats and do something that makes sense. Okay, there we go. Now, in the meantime, Portugal, when does my truce with you expire? It expires in exactly one year, and I think that's why I didn't attack yet, because if I wait not one year... <laughs> It expires in like five or six months. Six months, yeah. So in six months we can attack Portugal again. Take whatever we want from him. Lohenbergian ends back in Separatists. That's nothing. That is uh, a joke at this point. These are tiny rebels. We have the Agonese and Corsican Separatists to deal with. The Jolofians are currently not even threatening me. I believe they're sitting tight in Fulo. Who is currently guaranteed by something else. As long as they don't come to Trarza. I can probably... Uh, I can't do any conversions. I'm, oh, you're right. I'm annexing Silesia. Which is why my Diplo points are not doing so great. Silesia, a bit of a waste of a Diplo slot at this point. I'm at 10 out of 8 though, so it's not too bad. Um, okay, disputed succession with Congo. That's interesting. Ultimately irrelevant. Also, Congo hates me because I just ate his face. That'll do it. Um, right, so. Okay, our troops are here. Let's go kill that. The Corsicans, and then we'll deal with the Aragonese. One thing at a time. We are about two or three months away from my tour to Portugal ending. Yeah, April, March, Great Monopolies, in end of internal conflicts in Stronghai, that's fine. Um, Alright. Austria is allied with Salzburg. 
Thing is, Austria is worth uh, still a bit too much, I think. Truce with uh, Cascadia, Portugal, and all of those people has ended. Hey, Portugal! Can I attack you directly? I can probably attack... I have Conquest. Why do I not have Imperialism yet? Uh, I want Imperialism. I want it so badly. Can I attack these guys? Do I have a CB on them? I have Conquest. That costs me Diplo points. I don't even have a CB on uh, Nuremberg. Ah, that's fine. Who needs Diplo points anyway? Certainly not this guy. Let's just wreck all of them. There we go. Now Portugal's gonna get killed by Castille. So much for best friends forever. We've dealt with the Corsicans, let's go deal with the Aragonese. I assume the Portuguese navy isn't a threat for my Castilian ally. Uh, Lucan Separatist in Luca. Admittedly, that's what I get for uh, taking too long to get back to this run. I forget what I was doing. But... Uh, Clearly it doesn't matter too, too much. Ooh, Looming Disaster. Oh, Cordon County is back. Love me some Cordon County. It builds up quickly. Because I am inadequately stable. Uh, Battle of Luca has been won. That's fine. Let's get our boats to safety. Nice little two-deckers. Very cute, very adorable. Losing Diplo points all of a sudden. Did I lose my advisor? No, and I have a plus five advisor and it's still not enough, but that's also because my king is really bad at it. He's bad at the Diplo thing. Uh, Sienese spawned some Florence separatists. Let's assign a really good general and go kill them. Maybe let's use a second stack as well. Let's use enough troops. I'm not even encoring all this stuff. Ah. Magnificent. Our overextension is still pretty big, but it's under control. We don't have any overdue cores to take care of. I can eat Nuremberg right now. No one will care. Uh, it does not add the Ottomans to the list. The other ones don't matter. He won't accept though right now. That's unfortunate. Do I have... Is there a fort down here? I don't think there is. I think he lost the fort. Um, I don't know where the fort was, but I think he lost it, which means I can probably take his damn colonial empire. I want to finish ripping his colonial empire out of him because he doesn't deserve it. And it's also kind of annoying for trying to fight Portugal every time anyway. Um... Yeah, that's gonna be fine. Portugal is still the only member of the HRE. Uh, Portuguese separatists in Oporto. We have an army for that. Okay. Nuremberg is about to be eaten. Oh wow, well, these stacks should be separated at once. Integration is a slow process. Silesia has been uh, adequately integrated. We seem to be having some Genoese who also want to party. Why do I have so many rebels? Why am I so unstable? I guess it's because I'm not converting things fast enough. I do have three missionaries. What are the other two doing? Oh, they're probably working in subjects. Yep, there we go. They're trying to help the subject convert his own stuff. Very happy that Castilla is converting his own stuff. But, uh, oh, forgot to start the timer. I'm not used to timers anymore, so you guys get an extra long episode, probably. Unless I notice and pay close enough attention. Okay. Very good. What is this? We have what, random one boats? Oh, I'm building another navy over here. Oh, right, I'm building another transport fleet. Um. I can afford to lose legitimacy at this point. It's bad for my poor, poor absolutism, but it'll come back. CNA has converted. I can now probably want to convert my own stuff. Let's put fuck out of here, I guess. I have unlimited money at this point, so it doesn't really matter what I do with it. Actually, I should maybe try to invest some of it. That's not a bad use of it. There's some decent manufactories over here. 
These are not even worth making, but I'm building them anyway. Let's build some uh, some of these. Let's also look at, uh, at the religious map mode. If I want to convert things, I'm still coring all of this. But if I want to convert things, I'm better off building them where things are not the right religion yet. For easier conversion. Roma is one of them. That needs to be accounted for. I do have the Conquest of Rome though, which is a nice bonus, but I want to be able to convert, convert it. Oh, what is this? Sardinian Separatists? We still have one island that is occupied by Agonies that if I forget I will uh, be very unhappy about. But that will be dealt with. Then we will deal with the Sardinians. Um, Portugal is getting sieged pretty efficiently. So I should be able to make a nice demand out of it. Ooh, 1500 points for free. I will take them. I will certainly take them. Sardinian separatists cross the border. I thought that already happened. I did finish on sieging that, so that's good. The silly Balearis Islands. Um, Diplopoint generation is suddenly pretty good now that our vassal is annexed. That's why we weren't making any points, because we were annexing him too efficiently. Do I have room for states? I don't think I do. I have 46 states for 28 territories, and some of those territories are amazing. Holy crap. And some of the states I have, like Ven Venetia is only worth 27, is my weakest state. But it's not really a weak state, because I just don't have the rest of it yet. Potsdam flipped the Protestant. Let's not include subjects right now, let's flick fix our own stuff. There's a bunch of things we can fix. Uh, Florence is a good example of where I can throw a lot of money away. Ooh, measuring the world, yes! Measure that world! Let's measure it hard. Nuremberg wants peace. Hey Nuremberg, will you accept annexation? You will accept annexation, and there's still no one relevant that joins the coalition. There we go. Nuremberg has been eaten. Maybe I should feed it to uh, Brandberg. No, it's okay, I'll keep it for myself. I'll core it, I'll keep it core it. Um, trading in fish happened to us, that's cool. Castilian Particularists in Granada. Hey, Portugal! How do you feel? Whoa, he doesn't even want to give me white peace right now. That's extremely interesting. That he is so convinced of his own superiority. Um, that said, it seems his colonial empire is uh, winning and losing. What is this? Nassau. Oh, he's transferring some of the stuff to Nassau. That's fine. I'd like to have more war score, but Portugal's colonies are a source of problem, always. How much war score do I have against pure Portugal? Only 23. I have to wait until he drops to Lewin enthusiasm. Cine has been... Uh... Oh, hey, I have an army to deal with that, and it's not even dealing with that. I think I... Oh, I converted it already. Good. It should be a bit more stable. Um... Hmm... I can culture convert trade companies, but I cannot actually convert them. We got a bunch more angry people in Italy. In Italia. Let us uh, address that. The only way we know how to. Our nice little base 30 stacks are functional, but I don't know if they're the best we can have. The Ottomans are currently fighting the Knights. What is this? They're probably winning. The Knights in Venice. Yeah, the Ottomans are probably winning this. Um, I kind of want to try to fight the Ottomans. What are my ideas, though? Colonial Separatists. Um, my ideas are offensive, and I'm currently unlocking quality. I think once I have finished quality, I might be in a good position to fight. Between my Burgundians and offensive and quality and the policies that will go with that. Um, I should be... Oh, yeah, I'll get... Uh, I'll get this juicy 20 infantry combat ability, which will just complement uh, 
Those are terrible. But now I'm nine out of eight, so that's that's a bunch that's a bit better. I could probably annex Brandenburg as well. But again, the issue I'm facing is that I've run out of states. So annex annexing things is not that worth it. Which reminds me I probably should have been better off uh, feeding Nuremberg to Brandenburg. But that is not what happened. Colonial separatists in Cologne. What is this 12 stack? Oh, it's probably Silesia's army. Oh, that's fine. Okay, I have three stack over here. I have three cannons over here. What is this? That probably goes with this army. Probably that this army was being uh, built up into a... Uh, into a proper army. Is this boats? I think I was building more heavies as well. I forget why I was building so many... I forget why I was doing a lot of the things I'm currently doing. Okay, I'm gonna take the... Uh, that's the Silesian 12 stack. Can I upgrade it? Can I afford to upgrade it? Oh, I have room for it. I certainly have room for it. Uh, so I'm gonna upgrade it. Uh, do I have... Do I have rot? I don't want corruption, so... I'll root out the rot. Probably could have uh, given it to corruption, but... Eh. Let's get a base 30 going. We've lost uh, Grand Captain, which means I should have an advisor slot, yep. I can get a Morale of Armies guy. How's my money? My money is insane. Um, my admin point generation could be better. We'll upgrade to plus four. Where else did we get Rebels? I can get these armies over here. Where else did we get Rebels? I heard the sound of Rebels. Where do we have rebels? What rebels do we have? I have papal separatists. I have Portuguese separatists again. Oh, over there. Okay. We could deal with that. Uh, you have 30 boats over here, so that's good enough. Take these boats and bring them over here. Okay, you're about to be up here. Will it combine? Will it automatically combine? I'm not sure. Yes, it did. That's what I was thinking. This army is uh, trying to receive probably another cannon. Now we deal with the Papal Separatists. No Pope. There is no independent Popery. Oh, everywhere I've built these uh, cathedrals, the land converts very quickly. As it should be. Am I overextended? I'm barely overextended with Nuremberg now. If I wanted to build the right buildings for conversion, now is probably a good time for it. Um, these these, these places are capped. Albenga, Genoa, Liguria, Parme. Uh, Milan, Novara already have it. Okay, all of these already have it. Good, good. And all of these already have it as well. Excellent! So we'll be able to convert Italy. And now I want to convert Nuremberg as well, but... I'm running out of things to... Uh... Oh, hello. Unconverted province. Nassau doesn't count right now. It will eventually. There's two up here. And Hoya. Okay, I don't want to lose innovativeness. I'll just get some unrest. I've already established that unrest does not uh, phase me right now. We've built some more of those cathedrals everywhere. We've lost trade dispute against the Ottomans. The clan of the nobility has ended. I have my Cordon County that is building again. That's not too much of a concern. Uh, I cannot easily bump stability, but it's okay. I generate so many points right now. My advisors more than make up for my bad king. He's not even bad, he's just average. The hair is equally average. We'll, we'll write it out on average rulers. That'll be okay. Uh, I cannot eat Nassau yet. How does Port Portugal is still not at low. Portugal is still high. Um, ally in war plus 50. Wow. The question is... Oh wait, you ate that stuff? If I want to piece Portugal out... He will accept a peace right now. 
I cannot make that into a core, so I'm gonna want to take this entire chunk. I want Portugal to give me uh, as much of that as possible. I doubt he'll be willing to give it all to me. Uh, that's about the limit of what I can take right now. But yeah, I'm gonna try to gut his colonial empire as much as possible. It'll cost me 125 Diplo points, which is not nice, but such is life for that peace deal. I can do some more conversions. Let's get some more Italians uh, in line with uh, Pelican Include Subjects. I have Acuieri. Oh, right, I'm converting Norway as well. I can afford to lose 10 prestige. I'm not losing points if I can help it. Um, good. Now, the Ottomans, I need to do something about the Ottomans. I need to... Uh... But again, before I do it, I'm going to finish my... Uh... I'm going to finish my uh, idea group. My little quality ideas. And then we'll look at fighting the Ottomans. What do they have as ideas? They probably have quantity. They have quantity and they have quality. But they don't have offensive. So once I finish quality, I should in theory have much better units than them. And because I'm Western Tech and we're 1690, I will have better unit pips than them by far. So my troops should be destroying their troops. And equal amounts, look at that. Venice with only 20 is kind of... Well, he's doing terrible, but he's not doing awful against the 100,000 Ottomans. So we're gonna want to replicate this. Oh wow, it's down to 32. It's ticking very quickly. I'm probably gonna be able to attack Austria right after. Safely, rat, uh, safely at that. And the goal will be to form a donut around Austria. And then maybe to eventually fall annex him. Uh, rebels are looking fine. I could do it now, but I'm at war with, um, I'm at war with Portugal, so I can't really easily do that. Yeah, I have to stop being at war with Portugal first. And Portugal is only down to medium. He's not yet at low enthusiasm. Even though the war score is ticking heavily in my favor, and his uh, country is, like, fully sieged. Florence now has a true fate. Uh, it seems that... Uh, whoa, Florid is, uh, dying. Why are my colonial relations... Wait, what? Did I just see something, uh... Supporting the independence? Independence supported by Commonwealth. That... Okay, that's... Interesting, actually. France is almost loyal. I can probably improve relations with France. I have board diplomats. Let's have my board diplomats do something. That could resemble usefulness. Here you go, keep one open. Okay. France now has a positive opinion of us. They only have 20 liberty desire. Hopefully that makes them turn uh, happy. Now that they have a positive opinion. Hey Portugal. I don't think you got the memo. That I want 49 war score out of you. Maybe I'll need to take a bit less. Ooh, imperialism! Imperialism! It is here! The ultimate CB! Okay, so Portugal, maybe I won't take all of that. Maybe I'll let you keep some of that. Maybe... Oh, hey, I've gained the, the reach for this. Have I gained the reach for anything else? Doesn't seem like it. Okay, I'm gonna recall France for now. And I'm gonna let you have... Um, I want to say stuff that's inland. Or stuff that doesn't give you access to anything. There we go. There we go, that's, that's a good start. I'm gonna eat this chunk. Yeah, that seems good to me. Go away Portugal, no one likes you. Now I want to core all of this. I'm gonna core what I can. And of course now my Diplo points are gone, but they'll be back. And now we have Imperialism, so we're good for that. Okay, Nassau. Give me that. Stop existing. No one cares. Very good. How much of the stuff that I just stole contains Portuguese cores? Oh, some of them do. 
Interesting. He actually state cored some of this stuff. Oh, and this belongs to Castille. Hey, Castille, I have some stuff for you. Uh, no, I'll keep it for myself. I'll keep it for myself. Hey, Maravi. You're allowed to Mahalafali. Um... Alright, that's not a problem. Right now, I think it's Austria's turn. I think it is totally Austria's turn. And now we're gonna re-wreck um, Portugal. Because wrecking Portugal is our favorite pastime. A lot of these things don't have Portuguese cores. So, oh, the inland ones do, though. Portugal wants an unlawful territory. He's, he's funny. He tells hilarious jokes. Nassau is mine. I worked very hard for it. I'm gonna kill the rebels that come out of it, and I don't even care. Okay. Let's take care of Austria. I can lose 5,000 ducats for professionalism. Sure. That's nothing. Let's go help our poor little Brandenburg from himself. And also, we should be sieging all of... Uh, what is this? Fort Calier rebels. That's nothing as well. Our armies are all ready to march. We can probably afford another stack, even. Let's build another stack. I don't have anything to do with my money anyway. So this is done. Can you put generals in there? I don't know. All long as that right now, I'm sieging Austria with... Uh, with great purpose. Oh, he's taken that fort. Wow, he takes forts quickly. That's a level 2 fort, though. Why do I even have that level 2 fort? No idea. I'm gonna have to fix that. I'll probably forget to fix that by the time I get around to fixing that. Russia. Oh, Russia's a friend. How Russia? How, how many favors? Where are you at on favors? Oh, 42 favors. Extremely useful. Seam in hand. Who's dynasty? Oh, I'm at Rastamara. Okay. That is important to verify. Because spewing Russia sounds really nice. It always does. Venice, who are you like to? You're out to the Commonwealth. Siege of Prague is mine. Um, I probably don't want to fight Portugal too much. Because I want to core the other stuff I took. But that'll allow me to take even more of his empire from him. So I'll take what I can get. Hmm. Gotta unsiege what we, uh, what Austria took from us. Wow, he's taking them really fast. Akuyeri flipped the Protestant. Can now continue flipping my Italy and even Ditmashen apparently. Gotta try to stabilize our realm a little. Hey, Catholic Zoss and Ditmashen, look at that. When they want to really mess with you, probably gonna have to lose that siege, but that that uh, conversion, but it's okay. Oh no, I lost my uh, advisor. Let's get the uh, Diplo Rep guy. He can be leveled up to 5. Very important. Unlimited money. Make that to good use. Turn that into infinite points. Okay, go deal with the Catholic Zealous over here. I'm pretty sure if we get... Yeah, if we get a missionary from that. That'll be okay. Let's convert Clevs now. We have temples everywhere. We can protect our fate, which will give me a claim. And insult the commonwealth or settle the issue peacefully in new stability. <laughs> what is peace? But a state of not being at war yet. Let's go help our poor little uh, vassal here who's getting bullied by Austria. Ah, oh, I didn't make it in time. Poor Prussian guys. Montferrat is ours. Or rather, Montferrat has the right flavor of Jesus. It was already ours, but now it's properly ours, with our stamp of approval, our Burgundian stamp of approval. I can apparently core things, but I don't think I can core any of these things, that's the problem. Um, how much war score do I have against Portugal? I don't have his capital yet. Therefore, I only have 6% war score. It's gonna take a while to get more than that. But this time I'll try to take more of his... Uh, African colonies, more of his empire down here. Oh, it seems he's uh, sieging that. He wants it back. Can't blame him, but still. Sternberg is back in Brandenburg's hands. Right now I'm getting aggressive. I'm not, no, not aggressive expansion, but overextension. 
Not of extension. War exhaustion. There we go. The right one. Let's lose uh, 2,000 ducats because that represents nothing to our nation. Meanwhile, we're just gonna siege this Austria peacefully. City of Hod. We gained the CB against. Wherever that is. I do not even care. Um... Wait, are you not on the... Oh, I sent you there. Okay. Nuremberger Separatists. You go deal with that. Would help if I wasn't paused. I like my auto-pause feature, but sometimes it slows things down. <sighs> Excellent. All of this is... Uh, Ford Karten is in the way. How much war score is Austria worth? He's worth 101 war score. Can I bump my absolutism? Maybe I'll be able to just straight up vassalize Austria in one war and then not have to care. It's actually like I'm a little over my uh, my time right now, but if I can do this in one war, I can call the run with this episode. And given how uh, how I've not been able to find good time to record it, that may just be for the best. Hey Portugal, I need you to go to accept the peace. I don't even care if it's a white peace. Hey Portugal, let's talk about peace. You will not accept a white peace, not now even. It is very important that you do though. You're still high enthusiasm. Your military strength is not there, but you're still high enthusiasm. Hmm. Uh, I can gain mercantilism, so I will do so. Because, you know, more money. Always a good thing. Austria is bullying my vassal still. I haven't run into him yet. I kind of want to run into him. See what happens. He may have a tech on me, a tech with tactics. But I have some damn good military ideas. Oh, that is painful. Oh, he stack wiped it. Okay. All right. Austria plays rough. It was a close fight at even numbers. Went really south after a, uh, a little altercation. Okay, this is going to be transferred to Brandenburg. And it's just going to be fed to him. Which angers no one important. Salzburg will just have to accept it. Okay. Let's get some troops over up here. I don't think Austria will last much longer in this war anyway. I mean, I think he's gonna struggle a lot more with losses than I am. He sieged Moldavia. I can lose 100 ducats. I just could, I need more stacks, that's all. Can I get points from my nobles? Yes, I can, actually. Yes, I can. Which will allow me to finish off... Um, Oh, it's not, doesn't finish it off yet. I'm still missing one idea. Still, good progress. Very good progress. Ideas, I am, not ideas, but tech. I'm ahead of time in both techs right now. Mainzian Separatists and Mayans. I have an army that is bored. Can go deal with that. Uh, Austria seems to be dying against Prussia. Well, not really dying. He won. Wow, he sees just things so fast. It's unreal how quickly he sieges all this stuff. He does have a lot of cannons in his armies. Augsburgian Separatists. Once again, I have armies nearby. That's not a problem. The Siege of Lignitz is over. Let's go siege Poznan. Or unsiege Poznan, rather. Are you still uh, supporting the independence of France? You are still supporting it. France is now friendly. Which means I could royal marry him. Look at that. France is now happy about his uh, lot in life. I cannot core any of this stuff. Uh, Conflict or Quoten County. It is here. It is here. There shall be hardline centralization attempts. Marrakesh and Meknes. Uh, we're gonna have to go deal with that. I don't have enough armies down south. Let's go save Castille from Castille. Clearly his worst enemy has himself. Let's spend another 4,000 ducats. Hey, I can now refill garrisons. That's not very useful. 
Actually, it, uh, it is useful in the sense that you could mod ball forts and then unmod ball and then instantly refill all of your garrisons if uh, that was an option. Uh, we can. Uh, where's Ayrshire? Ayrshire is in England. Do I have an army to protect England? I do not. What is this? This is a stack of angry boats. Do I have an army? I can send an army to England. I will definitely arrest their leaders. But that's okay. I can pass. Uh, I won't be doing that. Monster Separatists. Up here in the German area. Not the Irish monster. The German monster. Um, I don't know where my boats are. I have two transport fleets. I have one up here. Also, these troops should not be there anymore. Let's send them over here. Do I have rebels anywhere else? Inside of these Castilian rebels... I feel like I heard the sound of rebels pop up. Um, if I have the court flick of Gordon County, maybe I can just ignore it anyway. Unless, wait a minute. No, this reduced my absolutism. So I have to wait for Gordon County to end. I will not be able to phonix Austria in this war. So I'm just going to call the episode now. So I'll thank you guys for watching. And I will see you next time where we'll Gordon County... And we'll uh, deal with Austria probably in two wars. One massive and one tiny one. See you guys next time.